Hello everyone! This video is on my recent haul from Vintage Chic Scents. Um, there are two orders in this haul and they are both RTS orders. Um, I think I might break this haul up into two separate videos um, because I got like, so the, the first order I got um, like a couple blossom bars, a couple different other shapes, and then like a bakery bag. And then the second order in this haul, I got four um, mystery sampler bag thingies. Um, what do they call them? What should you call these? Yeah, the, like mystery bags. Um, so I think those, I think if I combine them all together in one video, it might be like too, too long. Um, so we're going to see it. We're going to feel it out. I might have like the first part be like the first order and then like one or two of the sample or mystery bags and then the other part be the rest of the mystery bags in this haul so yeah anyway um so because there are two orders in this haul got two samples and the first one of those is in holiday barbie which is sugared spruce cranberry orange spice clove nutmeg and juniper poured 723 you can see my Gigantic bun. <laughs> and this is absolutely gorgeous. I love this. This is a beautiful Christmassy scent. Citrus, cranberry, spicy, Christmas tree y. Oh, I love that. Love that. And that's a new scent from them. Um, next is Christmas Time is Here, which is sugar cookies, Christmas trees, and a hint of peppermint. Port 823. I think this is a new scent from them, too. Oh, this is beautiful too. This is very Christmassy in a different way because of the peppermint and sugar cookies, but still very Christmassy, very Christmas tree y. Love that. All right. So we'll um, move on next to the other goodies in this haul. We'll do the first order first. You can see my gigantic bun again. You're welcome. Um, so. The first item in the first order, uh, besides the sample, is in Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, which is Tangerine Cranberry Cotton Candy Frosting for August 23. And I just think these shapes are so cool. So cool. And this is a new to me scent from them. I forgot what she calls these. The shape. Um, is it like the Mind Reader Bars or something like that? Oh, this is very interesting. This is still very citrusy and cranberry, but because of the cotton candy, it smells like a tangerine cranberry sweet tart. Very good. I like that. Um, and then I accidentally, <laughs> and I do mean it was an accident, purchased three, um, blossoms in the same scent which is in Martha's popcorn on the cob which is kettle corn vanilla butter fudge zucchini bread and rich vanilla cupcake and all poured August 23. Um so this was an accident of getting three of them. I meant to just get one. Um <laughs> I attempt like so when I added it to my cart the first time like it didn't it didn't like show up like it didn't like like the number didn't change so I was like what is that about so I clicked it again and then I don't know like what happened between my one extra click but then it added two more and then I tried to take them like when I went to check out and stuff I was like oh I'll just you know take them out when I get to check out and when I went to go check out I was like you know, money seeing the thing to like update my cart and stuff and it wouldn't do it. So I was like, but it would like, like it would reload the page, but it just wouldn't show the number smaller. So I was like, okay, whatever. Um, it'll probably just show up on the other end after I check out and it didn't. I purchased three of them clearly. <laughs> so hopefully I like it. And this is a new to me scent from them. So I don't know, hopefully it's not too salty and my husband doesn't think it smells like cat pee. Oh, that is very nice. It is salty. It does smell like popcorn. But it doesn't smell like 
the salty popcorn that he typically thinks smells like khaki. So I think this will be okay. And this is also very fudgy, very creamy. I like that a lot. It's a very yummy scent. Okay. And then I got a bakery bag of Peace of My Heart, which is Satsuma, mango sorbet, fresh picked strawberries, and spun sugar poured August 23. And I don't think this is a new to me scent from them. Oh, and I just, I love, love her Satsuma. And I mostly just get Satsuma and mango on cold. I don't specifically smell like sponge sugar or strawberries on cold. Ugh, oh, it smells so good. And just the Satsuma and mango alone is fantastic. I love that. Um, and then I got three Blossom Bars in this first order. First one of those is in Juliet's Cafe, which is one of my favorite scents from Vintage Chic Scents. Um... So this is Satsuma, Tangerine Sherbet, um, Sweet Whipped Cream, Fresh Picked Strawberries, poured June 23. Oh, I love this scent. It's so good. It's so good. Mm, I love it so much. It's like a little tart because it's tangerine. And then like the, the, the just the most delicious Satsuma which is also creamy and citrusy and sweet. Oh, and then the fresh picked strawberries is in there. It is such a lovely scent. I love it. Love it, love it. Um, and then the next one is in Sanderson Sisters, which is green apple, caramel, candy corn, marshmallow, poured June 23. And this is another one of my favorite blends from Vintage Cheek Scents. Love this one. Her apple, her green apple. So good with her caramel so good and to me her green apple doesn't smell like a jolly rancher which i love because i find the jolly rancher green apples to smell too sweet like kind of like obnoxiously sweet and this one is not like hers is very very good i love it um and then the last item in this first order for this haul is in frankenberry cream pie which is vanilla cream pie Topped with whipped cream and frankenberry cereal poured at June 23. And this is a new chimney scent from them. Oh, that is very good. See, like, so, I don't know. Like, I used to be really into cereal scents. Like, the frankenberry, Captain Crunch, Lucky Charms, um, Fruit Loops, like all of those. Fruity Pebbles. But, I don't know. Like, I really, really, um, really decided that I did not like the Crunchberry one, um, like, a couple years after I first got into wax. I was like, nah, I don't think that one's for me. But, I mean, I feel like Frankenberry smells very close to that, but more, more fruity, so I like it a little bit more, I guess. Um, but this mixed with the whipped cream and like the cream, like the vanilla cream pie and all that stuff. It's, you know, much more bakery and I like that. All right, so that is everything for my first order in this haul. Now let's move on to, oh, okay. Well, that's only like eight and a half minutes into it. So I'll probably put one or two of the uh, mystery bags from the second order in this haul in this part one. Uh, just put that out of, oops, out of the way. Okay. So, um, so that first order, I don't think I said, um, before I placed that on August 20th, 22, I placed that one on August 20th, 2023. Now this second order in this haul, I placed on August 22nd, 2023. And these are the four mystery samplers or mystery bags. And I got like a regular mystery bag. She had like five different kind, I believe she had mystery bag bakery mystery bag, fruity and fruity bakery mystery bag, fruity mystery bag, and then um, a fall mystery bag. And I was actually going to get one of each, but when I like got around to it, the fall one was absolutely sold out. And I was like, whoa, dang. Um, but so none of these ones are labeled. So they all come in a bag like this. Um, and they're not labeled or anything. So we're gonna take a guess together because I'm going to 
guess that obviously the fruity one is going to be all like fruity buns, so on and so forth. Now the mystery bag I think is just, you know, whatever. So <laughs> a blend of everything. Um, yeah, so let's get into it. Right, here's the first one. Let's try to guess which one this one is together. All right, so the first item we have here is in you're supposed to drink the milk sugar sugar milk sugar cookie dough sugar cookies and vanilla frosted grams poured august 23. ah that's cute so that's really cute i think this is amy teresa from them yeah very creamy yeah very sweet and creamy scent with um, cinnamon because I believe her vanilla frosted grams have a cinnamon note to them, that fragrance oil. Next, we have a bag of different Halloween shapes. This is in the Warrens. This is a not new to me set from them. Glazed cinnamon donuts, uh, cider, marshmallows, caramel, and then sweet cinnamon poured August 23. It's been a while since I've had this scent because it's like an apple cidery type of scent. But this one is like, I mean, I'm guessing because there's extra cinnamon in it. It's, you know, more cinnamon than a lot of other ciders by itself. It is a very good fall blend though. Um, next is chestnuts and brown sugar cupcakes. Yummy rich vanilla cupcakes smeared with brown sugar and chestnut frosting poured at June 23. Just a bag of different shapes. Looks like there's all the teeny tiny roses and half strawberries. New to me some from them. This is really delicious. Mmm, that is very good. It smells like a brown sugar cupcake. That is really yummy. Alright, and then we have Fall Fun Fest, which is pumpkin, pecan, waffles, yellow cake, and zucchini bread poured August 23. The scream mask and tree little pumpkins. This is a new to me some from them. Oh yeah, it was very good. Very pumpkin pecan waffles and cakey. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, and then we have Let Them Eat Cake, which is yellow cake, birthday cake, cupcakes at Tiffany's, support August 23. And this is a not new to me sent from them. Two pack of cute jack-o'-lanterns, I love that. Oh yeah, and this is so delicious, it is just, a load of different kinds of cakes and they all smell delicious and yummy creamy yum 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 <laughs> all right and then we have some kind of like tea cake <laughs> and this scent cherry vanilla jackie o which is vanilla bean cake with whipped marshmallows and cherries poured at june 23. And this is a new to me from them i do not like it this is um, very maraschino cherry to me. Not a fan, but it's a cute shape. And then we have an incredibly cute um, bunny shape in the scent marshmallow man's beehive, lemon, coconut, cream, butter cake, zucchini bread, gooey marshmallow poured February 23. How cute. And this is a not new to me scent from them. And I love this one. Like typically beehive is a little too tart for me, but mixed with this extra marshmallow, it just creams it out so good and it makes it smell like a lemon meringue pie um, on top of a cake, if that makes sense. Very delicious scent, please don't fall. <laughs> Next we have a tile and blackbird, which is yellow cake, gooey marshmallows, espresso, espresso beans, and zucchini bread, poured April 23. Again, not new to me sent from them. Very good. Sweet, creamy, dark um, coffee scent with a with zucchini bread. All right, and then we have a small ice cream scoop shape in the scent L, which is toasted eggo waffles with cinnamon and sugar butter poured June 23. So I'm going to guess that this is the bakery mystery bag. And, oh, and this is a not new to me set from them, by the way. And this smells exactly as described. It's 
smells like like a cinnamon sugar waffle very good all right so i'm guessing that is the bakery mystery bag and then bag number two first item of that is in belladonna a two pack of hearts sweet lavender honey ice cream raspberry sauce and blackberries poured march 23 i believe this is a new to me set from them oh yeah that is very raspberry very very raspberry it smells like raspberry jam with like a tiny hint of lavender okay then we have a two pack, oh, these are cute. A two pack of jack o' lanterns in the scent will always have Paris, which is an exclusive secret fruit blend. Um, poured August 23. I love this one. He has got the cutest face. Oh, and this is a not new to me scent from them. It has been quite a while since I've purchased it or like in an order or de stash, and I just. I love it. Forgot how good it was. There it is. <laughs> love that. Next is Elf Judy, which is um, Palo Santo, warm vanilla sugar, and cupcakes at Tiffany's. Poured August 23. Cute little jack o' lantern. New to me, set from them. Yep. And all I smell on cold is the Palo Santo. Not a huge fan of it, but I mean, it's not terrible. <laughs> um, next is another two pack of Jack O'Lanterns. This one is in strawberry season, which is sugared strawberries and fresh picked strawberries, poured August 23. Need to from them. Oh, that is nice. Oh, yeah, that smells very good. It smells like the um, like strawberry hard candy that comes in those cute little strawberry wrappers. Very, very nice. I like that. Next is a super cute bunny shape in the scent. Be careful what you wish for. Blackberry jam butter cookies, zucchini bread, fresh picked strawberries poured March 23. This is a not new to me scent from them. Mm, I love this. Her blackberry jam butter cookies is very good. Mm, love that. And get the zucchini bread and um i would say the strawberry comes out more on warm than you can smell on cold at least to me and my nose all right next we have a pack of stars in the scent casey becker which is banana cream pie blueberry cheesecake buttery vanilla fresh rolled dough gooey batter and sugared almonds poured may 23. this is a not new to me scent from them And I will say mostly on cold and warm. I just get like like a creamy banana scent. Um, but I will say that the blueberry does come out a smidge bit more on warm. Next we have a three pack of really pretty flowers in the scent pieces of Reese. Which is rich vanilla cupcakes, peanut butter filling, and blackberry jam. Poured March 23. This is a new to me scent from them, by the way. Hmm. Okay. Okay. It smells like a really sweet peanut butter and jelly sandwich, like blackberry jam jelly sandwich. Um, next we have a big bunt in the scent. My mom and dad are gonna be so mad at me. Cinnamon glazed donut, jello cake, and rich sugar cookies. Poured poured May 23. New to me scent from them. Very heavy on the cinnamon on cold. So mostly it just smells like a cinnamon donut to me on cold. I don't get any sugar cookie or yellow cake. Next we have a very cute bag of potion bottles. Oh, these are so cute. This is in the scent Baby Leroy, which is lavender vanilla baby magic, poured August 23. And this is a not new cheese from them.
Oh, this is so good. This is such a beautiful scent. Oh, I love it so much. Lavender goodness right there, man. And then we have, oh my gosh, these are cute. A two pack of super cute Easter shapes. This is in great cotton candy poured March 23. Look at that. Little Easter basket with the bow and eggs and the Easter egg. Oh, so cute. And that smells delicious. Smells like a grape Jolly Rancher. All right, so that was bag number two. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put the other two bags in this video too. Why not? We'll just keep going. Um, so I think that one is the fruity and fruity bakery mystery bag. So then here's bag number three. First one of those is in, oh, I forgot what the shape is called. It's like a camera or the film reel heart shape thing. This is in the Skylar, the Skylar Sisters. Raspberry Zingers, Yellow Cake, Raspberry Frosting, Vanilla Filling, Coconut Flakes, poured March 23. Very strong on the, um, this is a new taste on them. It is very strong on the raspberry part. It smells like raspberry jam. Next, we have a heart shape in the scent, in the same scent with the Skylar Sisters. Um, this one's poured in March 23. Oh, oh well, that's pretty. I don't know what those are. Okay. Um, next we have a bag of little tiny kisses and a medallion. And this is in the scent Weird Barbie, which is blueberry muffins and sugar milk poured July 23. I don't think that's like her regular medallion shape. This is a new to me scent from them, by the way. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's an, an odd scent to me. Like, I feel like there's like a little bit of a tart note to that. That is something I don't like. I don't know. Um, next is a really cute bag of bunnies and ducky shapes. This is in the scent I'll Be Right Back. Apple fritter sugar cookies poured March 23. New to me scent from them. Yeah, and this, this to me mostly just smells like apple pie, or not apple pie, like apple cinnamon porpourri, which I do find with a lot of like apple cinnamon -y scents, so, but it's very cute shapes. Next, we have a three pack of Easter egg shapes in the scent The Greatest Show on Earth, which is crisp green apples, creamy caramel, and mallow fluff poured March 23. This is a not new to me scent from them. Just another little Easter egg. Mm, I love this and it's so good. It's like Sanderson Sisters. Um, yeah, it's like Sanderson Sisters, but a little less creamy, I would say. It's so good. They're both delicious scents. Um, next one is this. This is cute. Next, we have a cute little pack of... Um, a sweet little bunny and three strawberries. This is in Good Morning, which is Fruity Pebbles, Juicy Blackberries, and Sugar Milk, poured March 23. Need to be sent from them. Ooh, okay. A sweet and creamy Fruity Pebbles with Blackberry. That is very nice, okay. Next, we have a two-pack of hearts in the scent Barbie Eat Your Heart Out, which is pink sugar, satsuma, strawberry, cotton candy, poured March 23. And this is a not new to me scent from them. I like this a whole lot. Mm, yes, I love it. Pink sugar, satsuma, strawberry. Love, 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 love. 
Next is a Dreamcatcher bar. This is a Nissan Pebbles and Bam Bam, which is pound cake, um, heavy cream, fruity pebbles, strawberries, and marshmallows poured May 23. Nissan sent from them, I think. Actually, no, I think I may have gotten a scent like a long, 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 long time ago. Like when I first got into wax and like she first came out with this scent. Oh, it's very good. I do get the strawberries on cold, which is nice. Because um, typically like, um, like citrusy cereal scents, especially Fruit Loops, like that sucker will just take over everything. But this is very nice. I like it. Okay. And then we have Snooky, a pack of really cute um, beachy shapes. And Snooky is Boardwalk uh, Marshmallow Clouds and Strawberry Pound Cake poured June 23. Maybe she set from them. Mmm, that is very good. That is very pretty. Oh, I love that a lot. Love that. I mean, I love her strawberry pound cake. And I'm not a huge fan of the Boardwalk Marshmallow Cloud set, but mixed with her strawberry pound cake, it is very nice, very pretty. So it'd absolutely be a delicious uh, Bath and Body Care product scent. All right, so that's the third one. So now, now I'm confused. <laughs> so the first one I'm pretty sure is the Bakery Mystery Bag. Now the second and third one, um, are both kind of like, I don't know, I want to say the same, but like, not the same, but I want to say, because there's Baby Magic in the second one, I want to say that one is probably the mystery one, and then the third one, like the just the regular mystery one, and then the third one is the Fruity and Free Bakery mystery one. All right, now here's the fourth one. So the first one of that one is in Over the Rainbow, which is Rainbow Sherbert Cotton Candy. And a cute little pack of um, Halloween shapes for August 23. Oh yeah, and that just smells exactly like Rainbow Sherbert. Beautiful. Next we have a Blossom in the Sun. It was all a dream. Lavender sugar cookies, coconut cream frosting, and fresh picked strawberries poured April 23. This is a not new to me scent from them. And this is beautiful. Just the lavender, the creamy coconut, strawberries. So good. Next is a smaller blossom, and this one is in the scent Annette's Beach, Par or Beach Party Punch, which is fruit bunch, orange, strawberry, pineapple, and pistachio poured May 23. This is a not new to me scent from them, but I'm not a fan of it. Like it isn't, it's definitely a fruity punch. And I do get the orange. It smells like, um, like the Kool-Aid fruit punch with like a hint more cherry. I'm not a fan of it being, you know, because of that, but it is a nicer fruit punch than other vendors fruit punches I've smelled before. Um, next is a partial bag of Chantilly or Chantilly Shatter, however you like to say it. This is in Too Much Pink Never. Bum Bum Pink Sugar Cotton Candy poured August 23. And this is a new to set from them. Hmm. And really all I smell on cold is the Bum Bum and the Pink Sugar. And I smell them equally. Um... But I would like to smell like the specific cotton candy scent too. So I hope that comes out more on warm. Um, next is a bag of little tiny flower shapes. And this is Now and Then, which is strawberry cream soda poured August 23. And this is a not new piece from them. And I love it. It's so good. A very, very creamy strawberry soda scent. So good. So good. Then we have a large bunt in the shape, 
no shade. And the scent Omega Beta Zeta, fresh picked strawberries, apricots, coconut cream, and warm vanilla sugar poured May 23. Need to need scent from them. Hmm. Okay. Well, I really only smell like a perfumey apricot scent on cold. Um, which I do find with a lot of apricot scents, they do come off a little more like perfumey and floral to me. Next we have a little bag of blossoms. This is in the scent. My job is beach. I think that's what it says. Um, this is volcano, pineapple, cilantro, and ginger ale poured July 23. I'm going to need to from them. Oh, this is very unique. Very different. Okay. Okay. That is interesting. Like, I like the cilantro is not, like, slap you in the face. Like, you're cooking with it kind of cilantro. It is a very different scent. Very hard to describe. Very beachy, tropical. All right. Next is a small, like, partial bag of Chantilly or Chantilly Shatter, um, however you like to say it, in the scent Piece of My Heart, which, again, is Satsuma, Mango Sorbet, Fresh Picked Strawberry, Sponge Sugar, Port August 23, um, same as the um, Chantilly Shatter bag, bakery bag that I got in the first order in this haul. There's that. Love, 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 love. Um... Next is a bag, a little uh, bag of really pretty blossoms, beautiful color, and the scent Tangerine Twist Barbie, which is swimming pool, fresh oranges, and tangerine dreams poured July 23. New to me scent from them. Oh, that is very, very good. I don't know what swimming pool is, but it makes whatever this is like whatever this whatever this swimming pool scent is it makes the oranges and tangerine in here like just something different it's really good i like that a lot and then the last item in the second order and in this haul is in um a two pack of really cute halloween shapes in the scent we'll always have pears which again is an exclusive secret blend, fruity blend, um, for August 23. Love the scent again, and not new to me scent from them. Okay, so I am confused. <laughs> um, so, so I'm pretty sure the first one is the bakery mystery bag. I'm pretty sure the second one is the um, just regular mystery bag. I think the third one is the fruity and fruity bakery mystery bag. And then I think the last one, the fourth one is the fruity mystery bag in the second order here for this haul. So <laughs> that is everything for my most recent haul, RTS haul from Vintage Cheap Sense. Thank you all so very much for watching. Have a wonderful day. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.